it's time. It's time once again to open up a McEwen's. One of the very few McEwen's left in the United States. McEwen Scotch Ale. Got our trusty McEwen's church key that we will use to open it. We've got our McEwen's van <laughs> in the hopes that it will soon deliver more to us. There is a uh, recent potential of that happening. We hope it will. So, uh, it's hard telling how old this beer is. It may be, well, we know it's, we know it's at least two years. It's, it might be as much as three or maybe four years old. So, uh, it has been cellared down here in the basement, and uh, we hope it's still good. So, I think we should open it. Definitely don't want to spill this. So, wow, I, I remember that smell. It's been a year since since this is. Oh, yeah, it's been a year since we've enjoyed a McEwen's. So, here we go. any of it. Get it all in there. Just a tiny little bit of a head there. <sighs> I can't imagine what it's going to taste like. All right, here it goes. Mmm. It's McEwen's. Still good. Still sweet, malty. Um, It's hard to say what it tastes like. Definitely, definitely malty, caramely. Some people say raisin and toffee. I don't. I'm. I'm, I'm not too big on all those different uh, words to describe it. But uh, but it's 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 unique. It's it's sweet. Although it seems to have mellowed a bit from what I can remember as far as carbonation wise and smoothness. I don't remember it being this smooth. Um, but it is still good nonetheless. So.